Okay, everybody, I have got a update for you guys. This is going to blow your mind. Um, let me go ahead and get this pulled up real quick. I received this in a Facebook message from one of my friends. Um, but ISIS had learned about the interest. Hold on. Okay. Here, watch this, guys. Pass this video onto everyone you know. I'm not even shitting you. Okay, because if this turns out to be true, we just blew the top off of this. Alright guys, I just got some information from a friend I've known my whole life, more than 20 years. He's friends with Anonymous. I mean, the real Anonymous. The ones that are actually doing the hacking. Not just normal people who join Anonymous. Well, anyway, he sent me some screenshots of what Anonymous has put out on the internet. Evidently, Anonymous has hacked the Las Vegas Police Department's computers. And they found some notes being... Uh, sent back and forth between the FBI and, and the police. I'm going to put it all up on the screen for you guys, and I, I'm going to go over it in one second. I'm just asking you guys to do one thing. You need to share this video everywhere because I have to title the video strangely or Google and YouTube will flag it, pull it down, and delete it. So nobody's going to want to click on this video and nobody's going to see this video if you guys aren't sharing it because it's titled so weird. But anyway, let me let, let me just jump right into it. I'm going to give you guys the information. After I give it to you, I'm going to put it on the screen. I mean, I'm going to put it on the screen so that you can see where it was sent at, like so you can track the information down for yourself. Um, OK, so this is probably the realest we're ever going to get from the Las Vegas thing, this information hack. Um, Stephen Paddock was an FBI agent supplying arms to ISIS inside the USA. The LVMPD knows the motive behind the attack, but the FBI will not allow us to release the motive because it implicates the FBI in illegal arms deals and supplying arms to ISIS terrorists inside the U.S. borders. Stephen Paddock was an undercover FBI agent who participated in multiple illegal arms deals in the Las Vegas area in a gun-running entrapment scheme similar to Fast and Furious. Paddock thought he was engaging in another routine arms transfer. Um, but ISIS had learned about the entrapment scheme and Paddock's true identity. They killed him and carried out the massacre and then fled the scene. Um, everything is being kept under extreme wraps because armed ISIS terrorists are still at large. And this is very embarrassing to the FBI and they don't want the scheme to become public knowledge. I'll be putting further information up. That there, there's still some more. I'm not going to read it all. Um, this is in regards to the cameras. It's also mentioned the reason Stephen Paddock had cameras up everywhere. Because he was an FBI agent. Because he was recording the arms deal he was about to do. They were supposed to bust the ISIS terrorists before they carried out the massacre. Everything got all screwed up. But anyway, he did have cameras set up. The cameras and video are being examined by the FBI. So look, I got to title the video weird. It's not going to get out. Nobody's going to see it. I'm counting on every single person who views this to share it everywhere they can. If you guys don't share it, it's not going to get out. And you owe me for this one because I'm in trouble. My wife's trying to put the baby to sleep and I'm keeping him up. So you guys owe me. Share this video. Get the information out. I'm going to title it funny. I'm counting on you guys. Spread the word. Okay, you guys, um, that was like completely um, ridiculous. So let's let's uh, let's spread the word here and get everything out as soon as possible. Make this go viral. Let's find out and do some investigating to see how real this really is. If it is real. If it, um, if it is real, we just blew the top off this entire case. Pass this on to everyone you know. Again, you guys know this. I'm not make, making any money for this. I'm doing this to find out the truth on everything. Pass this around now, please. All right, you guys take care. Um, 
I'm going to try to save this somehow. I'm going to put it up on, I think, mid, uh, VidMe, and that way I can save it or something. I, I don't know. But uh, let's, let's keep this going, and uh, hopefully it doesn't get flagged and taken down. If it does, I've got it hooked up in my messenger, uh, so I can probably get it back and uh, post it again. So you guys take care, and I'll see you guys next time. God bless. Stay safe, be safe, and as always, I've got your six.